Libra. Hello and welcome to your collective reading, collective weekly reading for the week 18 to 24 of January. Let's see what the energies have for you for this week. First of all, I see a situation um, either you leave somebody behind in your love life and you go with the flow or you are the one left behind. Um, but the one, if you are the one leaving someone behind what you're trying to do is not the best idea because you are um, wandering with more than one partner partner just to maybe kill the time or fill the void in your heart if you're the one left behind um you're going to be a lot in your mind about what happened. You're going to be sad. But fortunately enough, you have um, you have a hu um, an accomplishment for your uh, love life. Although it's not as big of, as uh, you expect it to be, but it's going to be an accomplishment. This accomplishment will happen with a person whose name starts with an R. Roxanne, Robert, something. Um, may not be the happiest situation ever, but mm, this is what I see. You'll, you're going to try to do something create something with your own hands you're like modeling clay or doing something with your hands you try to do something and a person whose name starts with an E Eric uh, bold and it seems to be a man will be watching you and protecting you um this person uh, will watch you and protect you from far with love he won't tell you that you won't know about this love but he'll be there protecting you while you try to do something he's gonna be kind of a, um, your guardian angel Yeah, I see again the symbol of uh, ending something, cutting something. You have a huge scissor in the bottom of your mug, which means you are ending something. So um, it might be that you are the one leaving behind the other person. Um, and although you are the one maybe leaving behind the other person, you will feel a lot of fear. There's a lot of fear. You feel very shy, very insecure. And um, you will have by your side a very faithful friend who will guide, guard you, help you, guide you, support you. Um, but besides this friend, you have another person who will be around you. And he's not... He's a very dominant person um, although he appears in the image of a baby lion um, he's not fully developed but he is a dominant person with a beautiful um, energy um, and this is a person uh, 
who's also next to you, taking care of you, helping you. Who might be, this might be a, um, a son, a brother, a nephew, um, a young person who will be there to support you. But this young person has a very dominant, proud, proud personality. Not in a bad way, but he will become a beautiful lion someday. Um, <clears throat> also in the bottom of your mug, you have um, a star. A star means joy, means happiness, means um, successful situations. So if you have this star in the bottom of your mug, it means in your love life, you're going to have successful relationships, success, successful situation in love that will be wonderful for you. So don't cry too much if you are the one left behind or don't feel too guilty if you are the one living behind, but think about the future. The future will bring beautiful, beautiful situation for you. Although for if although for the moment it seems like it's nothing beautiful. Um, in your future, future, you it seems like you also put behind you will put behind a person who pretended to be a friend and that person you loved so much dearly it was so dear to your heart but you will put behind this person because it's <clears throat> it's a fake friend and you will just leave behind this person Um, in the future, you will receive a news for love. And um, attached to this heart, that means the love, you have two letters, a G and a D. I don't know if they have any meaning for some meanings for some of you, but um, they are there. You have to build your self-trust for the future. You have to trust your strength, your inner power, your um, ability to dream big and act big and stop being so shy and so um, introvert and so um, trust yourself. Do something to, to build your your um, your self-trust and your self-respect and your self-image because um, the fact that you are so shy and so introvert and so insecure it's um, it's not a good thing for you it won't help you uh, in your future there is also there's also going to be a protection from a man that smokes because I see him with a cigarette in his mouth um, and this man comes with a new beginning an offer maybe a job offer maybe a love offer but it comes with um, good news protection new beginning um, In your house, I see you lying in your bed. And um, your family is around you. It's not like you're sick or something. But uh, you just relax and uh, everybody else is around you. Even if they're not physically around you. If you keep in touch with your family. And you talk to them all the time. And they appear to be present in your life. 
and you are, um, as I said, lying in your bed with all the family around and you talk to each other. You enjoy a pleasant conversation, which is good. You have a small fear connected to this uh, picture of the happy family talking together. Maybe you're worried about something related to your family. Or someone in your family may be pregnant. I see a gift in your house. Maybe you'll receive something and it's a gift in money. Maybe you receive some money from work um, as a compensation for uh, a project or it's the salary day or I don't know. But it doesn't seem to be salary though because it's a gift. It's not something that you receive every day. You will receive a small amount of money no matter where this money comes from, you will receive some money. Um, also in your house, you have um, a small cheerful moment, happy moment that will bring joy to your heart. Um, and this, um, this happy moment, this pleasant moment for your heart will be brought by a guy who wears a moustache. Uh, take care of those uh, fake friends because I see again the cat. You will put it behind in the future. But in the moment, in this moment, it has uh, the paws just wrapped around your neck. They are friendly and loving and pretending to be the best friendship in the world, what you two have. But it's not. But you have friends, faithful friends, true friends. You also have those. Yeah. Well, my dears, this was it. I'll be waiting for you in our next reading. Goodbye.